When one walks into my classroom, they will be able to see and hear and actually feel like they are in the world or different parts of the world. I'm excited about this school because I personally believe very strongly in being a lifelong learner. And I desire to instill that in the children in my classroom. The Wisconsin International School enrolls motivated students in pre-kindergarten age three through grade eight for a college preparatory international curriculum using state-of-the-art technology, small class sizes, quality faculty and staff in a diverse and welcoming community. We are going to start teaching Spanish or Mandarin. It will be a choice for the parents. The, it is very important that our children from a very young age start learning a second language. We are good to um, learn, to lo and learn a lo another language because when you go to some, somewhere, then you could speak to other people. With our school, we are um, committed to having the small classroom sizes, and I think that'll give each student the ability to flourish and to really be able to um, reach his or her potential and um, give the teacher the ability to assess and evaluate each child on an individual basis, which is so important. No, I can do this. Oh, you get it now? Okay. Parents are vital members of the Wisconsin International School and are actively involved in their child's development. They share their insights with faculty about their children's strengths and challenges have the opportunity to participate in their child's school day by following lesson plans, seeing their child's work, and reviewing their homework on our website. Very important for the uh, kids in Wisconsin because most of the kids, they are not exposed to uh, outside world. And even the parents, some of them, they, don't, uh, they are not uh, very familiar with the other people. So this way, the kids from young age, they are exposed to uh, different culture and different language, and they will be able to go anywhere and do anything they want. My children attend the Wisconsin International School because at, at this school we can think of um, ourselves as part of a community that's not only the neighborhoods where we're from and the state that we're from and being part of the United States, but also how we fit into the community um, as part of an international community. And so um, I think that coupled with the rigorous academics make this school a unique choice for, for um, us and a good fit for our family. It's kind of hard at first because we don't know anything, but once you start getting into it and you start understanding, you can probably start understanding more of the things that you're learning about and how to speak different languages. The curriculum is actually called International Baccalaureate, and that's kind of a big word for really teaching children to, or promoting respect and understanding among cultures of the world. We desire to bring this into the classroom through some overriding themes. Every day as we plan our units, we want children to be thinking about things like, you know, who am I in this world? Where do I fit in this world? How do I express myself in this world? You know, extracurricular activities, the all-round um, development, like arts and science, um, there's uh, music programs, there's arts programs, which uh, I think uh, helps in the overall shaping of, of my kid. It is uh, important to go on field trips with students to visit museums and art galleries where they see how other artists portray uh, and show their work. The difference in the art curriculum is that it includes uh, uh, different countries uh, and it's more global. The main goal of the International Baccalaureate is to inspire each child to achieve his or her personal best preparing them for a life of active, responsible citizenship. WIS endeavors to develop international mindedness in our students. I think we are just gonna um, really help the community, I think, as a whole. And we're not just looking at the school, and it is about the community and the world and how, um, not only how we wanna teach the, our children to look outside of themselves, but we're hoping that 
with this curriculum and with our whole, I guess, belief system that we want everyone, the family and the communities, just to really understand that this world is getting smaller and we have to really learn to reach out to one another and be in touch with each other and appreciate our, our backgrounds and our ethnicities and our race and embrace one another. Open to the world and open to the future means communicating with the world.